The Chromaticity Diagram app includes two tools. One is to open templates with CIE Chromaticity Diagram where data points can be added, and the other is to calculate CIE XY or U prime V prime from photoluminescence spectra, which are then added to the PL data in the Chromaticity Diagram. To begin, select the app icon in the Apps Gallery window. Next, select the first button to open a workbook template. Select the Chromaticity tab to view the templates for CIE 1931 and 1976. To open the graph window, simply double-click on the worksheet cell. The boundary of the Chromaticity can be found in the Boundary Worksheet. Column A, B, and C are boundary data for CIE 1931, and column A, D, and E are boundary data for 1976. Here, I have XY data, and I want to know the distribution in the chromaticity diagram. I can simply drag and drop my data file directly onto the template. I can then change the data plot from line to scatter by double-clicking the graph to open the plot details dialog. Under Plot Type, select Scatter. Before zooming into a graph, first double-click the axis, which will open the axis dialog. Select both Horizontal and Vertical, and, and under Rescale, select Normal. Select OK. Now select the Scale In icon and drag the area of interest to zoom in. Select the Back Arrow icon, which will add the embedded graph back into the chromaticity worksheet. Here I have photoluminescence spectral data and I want to know its color in terms of standard observer. Select the PL icon which will open the dialog. I can select one sample or multiple samples. For this example I will select CIE 1931. For graph settings select scatter and select show PL spectral labels in CIE plot to show labels for each sample on the diagram. Select OK. Here, each PL spectrum corresponds to a point in the chromaticity diagram. The workbook data that refers to this graph is automatically hidden in the project. However, I can quickly view the workbook by going to the Project Explorer and activating the chromaticity diagram workbook. Select the worksheet tab PL and here, the first four columns contain the CIE standard observer color matching functions that are used to calculate the X, Y, or U prime B prime coordinates. To view all origin apps, select the Add Apps icon, which will open the App Center dialog. Here, I can search for an app, and I can as well select the Download icon, which will automatically download and install the app onto origin. Once installed, the Apps icon will display in the Apps Gallery window. This concludes this tutorial. To find out more, please visit our website at www.originlab.com apps. Thank you.